Hey there, it's John Siskovich. I have 20 little piglets who are now all around my waist, chewing on my shoes and the stool that I'm sitting on. And I uh, wanted to make a video about my pig brooder. It is early April and the uh, pigs aren't ready to go out in the field yet. They're still kind of small. They're still really young. It's a little, a little cold outside. So I'm gonna walk you around the brooder, show you where, how I'm taking care of them now. Can we stop chewing on it? So as we look around my pig brooder, I have a warm area. This guy's hanging out in the heat. Just some 250 watt chicken lights that I had from brooding chickens. I have some rubber bowls that were all against the wall, but they've pushed them around. That has feed in it for the pigs for now. I have water bowls, which I change out a couple times a day. And then I have a, a roiling mass of piglets having a blast jumping on my egg crate that I brought in here to sit on while I was shooting video. I'm gonna add into this space some toys for them to play with and you know some things for them to do while they're in here before they can go out in the pasture. And other than that, let me hop on the other side of the camera and I'll walk you around what I did. So the space that we're in is just a shed that I had on property. I put down some hay and some pine shavings. That's what I had on farm. I didn't do any size calculations for how big of an area because I don't intend on keeping the pigs in here. I raise pigs on pasture, but it's early enough in the year where I wanted to have a space where the pigs could stay warm, get a little bit bigger, and once they're hardier, and once the weather's a little bit nicer, I'll bring them outside and they'll spend their days on pasture, you know, eating grass, fooling around, having a good time, enjoying the sunshine. But for now, while it's cold outside, they have this space. So I just found a secure space. I looked for any obstacles that they could chew on, electrical outlets. I moved an electrical outlet out of their reach. Um, any nails, because it's an old shed, I looked for any nails, any sharp pieces of metal. Uh, this is a concrete floor that they're peeing and pooing on right now. Um, and just put down my bedding. I'm gonna keep them dry, keep them warm keep them safe, gradually harden them off and get them ready for pasture. Hope that they don't chew on my pants anymore <laughs> than they're doing right now. And um, yeah, they should be happy pigs ready for the grass in a couple weeks. So that's that. If you have any questions about a pig brooder space, honestly, I don't know that I can answer them because uh, you know I'm still new to raising pigs. I just wanted to show you guys what I'm doing. This isn't the way to do it. This is my way that I'm doing it this year. Uh, as I learn, I'll keep sharing it. That's the benefit of subscribing to the channel. Thanks for stopping in. Enjoy the piglets, and I'll see you very soon. You gotta check this out. These little curious pigs are all chewing on this egg crate that I'm sitting on. It's kind of awesome. Very smart, very curious animals. You guys wanna be on video? You all right with that? <laughs> You're all excited. Leave the shoes alone. <laughs>